What's going on, everybody? Welcome to G Myers World. And right here, we're bringing you some Randy Moss and Night Train Dick Lane. Uh, what the F? I didn't really mean to say the dick part of his name, but yeah, Night Train Lane gameplay. And uh, we're going to go ahead and jump into some of this game. And uh, we're going to talk about the fact that a lot of dudes call things dots that it, it never used to be called a dot. You know what I'm saying? Like, these dudes are running around throwing the ball. Like, look, yeah. All right, I'm going to swerve you. I am the swerve god. I know I'm going to do it to you. It's kind of wild. It's like a whirlwind driving you out of the stadium. And stuff like that i understand that but on the other side i don't get like usually i you know i put out a game where i played another dude uh we tote 30s that also could swerve uh very very well and we had a really really wild and enticing game and it was crazy because every time he swerved me it just, i was just like yo what the f i wanted to freaking yo just do wild stuff probably travel to antarctica and just kick a baby seal but that's not that's not my point about it bro the point it's not about the point of it hurting it's the fact that it i have to respect his user you see, when you just throw the ball in the air, right, and anyone can do it, it's just like anything else. Like, if anybody could do what LeBron did or, or, or does, like with his specimen of character, uh, his body type, everything like that, he wouldn't be unique. You know what I'm saying? Like, everybody can't do what LeBron James does. You know, you got a Russell Westbrook, you got a LeBron James, but LeBron James is LeBron James. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's not many 6'9", 250, 60 pounds, you know what I'm saying, dudes running around. Like, look, bro. It, it doesn't matter what people say about, you know, the comparisons with him, Michael Jordan. I'm not going to get into all of that. What I'm saying is everybody can aggressive catch. Not everybody can swerve. So there must be something going on with that where there's a skill gap. It's sort of like this, right? You can't strafe anymore since Madden 16 or 17. If you try to strafe, you slide out of the stadium. Maybe you go try to talk to a side chick on the sideline. I don't know. You do everything else other than play where you're supposed to be playing, right? That's not fair to dudes that have user control and want to try to intercept the ball. Most of these bums, they rely on the com Oh my god, yo, that was an A gap. Most of these bums rely on the computer predetermined picking the ball. That doesn't make any sense. But it, but then again, a lot of dudes that play the game wanted more D line user jump the snap crap. Because dudes actually play on their D line. I'm telling you, there was a time, right, where when you play, if you played on your D line, it, you were a joke. It was like, yo, is this guy serious? Like, what is this guy? Like, I, bro, I, I'm telling you right now. I don't know about, you know, a lot of other tournaments that was outside of New York State, New Jersey and stuff like that. You know, in the early 2000s or whatever like that when Madden was really, really good. But um, I'm going to tell you this right now. Oh, my, yo, bro, I, I, I just lost my train of thought with that pick right there. I had to lurk him mad hard. But I'm t I, I went to tournaments, bro. Every single person that was there, even the like the, the tournaments was like, I think it was like 13 and up. Some of them were hosted by Best Buy. Some of them were like, it was like, oh, okay, pick me up. Pick me over the predetermined one right quick. Um, they were hosted by different companies that, you know, paid out like, what, 5,000, 10,000, whatever, whatever it was, right? Um, yo, pick that. But the thing about it is the younger kids, even the younger dudes were on a linebacker. Or some dudes are like really, really bold and played in their safety, but usually they're playing like cover one and stuff like that. And I don't know if you guys remember back when the four six bear was like really, really wild and savage, and you would like shift the dudes to the left, and the dude would come off the left screaming every play and stuff like that. Um, though, okay, you see stuff like that. That anybody can do that. That catch right there is so dumb and ridiculous, but it doesn't really matter. That's neither here nor there. I'm not even getting into that. But what I'm saying is because of the people that like to be able to be on their D line user and get instant pressure and stuff like that. The game has changed. You got, look, I'm, I'm gonna say this right now. D Jones, right? D Jones made a living off of rushing one person or nobody and getting sacks. D Jones, bro, like the dude, I, look, I played him and I've never seen Sag D like that in my life, bro. Like there was nobody, it was so wild. And his, his Sag D covered the run, the pass, everything, bro, covered, yo, it didn't even matter, bro. The dude was just savage with it. Now look at this right here, fourth and 19. My guy, look, look at him, look at him. Hot, the ball went right through my hand, bro. I don't care what none of you guys want to say. The ball went right through my hand on 4th and 19. But like I said, I expected that because everybody gets stupid on 4th down since Madden 16. They just drop all their awareness and they become complete more. Look at the ball just tipping around. Okay. Bro, I, I didn't I, Yo, I don't know what that was, man. I don't take no credit for that. Shout out to EA Sports for letting it happen. But I, it was making that ball noise. You know what I'm talking about? Like, do, 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 do. You, I don't know. Yo, whoever did that, whoever came up with that ball noise, the ball noise sound, get them a raise right now at EA Sports, bro. Because that is the dumbest thing ever. And if it was allowed to be put in the game, that guy deserves a lot of credit for pitching it the way he pitched it. Because I don't know, bro, I, I don't understand. It's just a lot of things that go on that I just don't understand. 
Yeah, that, that was a dot right there. That, that's a dot. You know what I'm saying? Dude hit me with an out route. He knew I was playing a different type of, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to not to make him score really, really quickly. So he's taking what he's getting. Those, those were dots. You know what I'm saying? But what? What? What is this? What's this? Okay. But yeah, I'm mad. You, bro, you guys are mad at swerving though. First of all, I'm underneath the route, right? And I was trying to straight to pick it with Anthony. But yo, let me just pick this up real quick with uh, Sean Taylor. So I'm underneath the route. And I'm simply trying to strafe to pick the ball, right? So the computer moves me, the, the computer takes over the animation and allows me to move out of the way so that he could then moss Paul Krause. How does that make any sense? This is what I'm like, bro, you, I, I don't know. I, I just don't understand what's going on. It doesn't make any sense. These things cannot be in Madden 18, but it probably will. Probably just toned down. Like a lot of the, a lot of the aggressive catching, in my opinion, was toned down a lot in Madden 17. You know what I'm saying? Like, it was toned down, but it's still there. Like, you can't really catch a golden take catch, but they try to do the same animation. You know what I'm talking about? So they do recognize that people were very, very upset about it. You know what I'm saying? I'm pretty sure they watched some of my videos. I was living, like, right here. I'm trying to strafe, right? I try to strafe. They move me backwards so that he could rocket catch me. How did... Yo, yo, pick that. Give me that, man. Use a pick. Let's go, bro. Game's over, dog. But it's not even about that. I'm happy that they gave us back a little bit of user control that I was able to click on and go and pick that ball, but I still can't strafe. There's still predetermined picks. There's still dudes getting mossed with the computer moving me out the way remotely. That doesn't make any sense. Why am I being slid out of the way? Like it, it slid me inside so that his animation of jumping straight up in the air could catch the ball. But you guys are mad at swerving. That, that doesn't, like, look, bruh. I understand that you guys want to have, like, this is a dot right here. Like, a lot of dudes are saying that this is a dot. How is that a goddamn dot if I lose control of my player so the animation could take over? Let me know what you guys are thinking. Until next time, one love.